Mr. Filippini, thank you for this uh, interview. I'm looking uh, forward to find out uh, interesting things about this uh, new project you are going to develop here in Ploiești. Um, during the research for this interview, yeah. we found out that you are a very strong company with projects in uh, very different countries, Italy, France, um, also, you are not um, strange from projects here in Romania. Tell me, uh, which one of these projects do you think um, it's for your soul? Ah, yeah. So, for us, it, it uh, as you just said, it's not our first project in Romania. But for us, uh, so to create landscapes everywhere, it's always a nice challenge, you know. So, that's why we we get this uh, chance to challenging again in, uh, in Romania. So we hope to to solve a nice uh, solution to get new concept for your project. Second time here in Prahova. Yeah. yeah, second time right here. Yeah, in Prahova. First uh, time you tell uh, you told me earlier yeah. in Voleni de Monte. De Monte. Yeah. And now here in Ploiești. Yeah, two times. Huh? Two projects. Please tell me, which was the most difficult project for you up until now and why? So, uh, every project for us, it's not difficult, but uh, every every project has the challenge inside. You okay. Know? But uh, one, one above all, I remember one in uh, a private island in the Middle East where the client asked to make it 100% sustainability mm -hmm. so that's why we try to choose the right plants uh, able to survive in salt water wow. and then to so strong to resist to a very strong winds so this is what one of the most difficult yes but in the end uh, it was uh, he was satisfied yeah I'm, with the results yeah i'm satisfied Please tell me, have you ever calculated uh, the entire land surface that you transformed through the projects you have built? Oh, oh, honestly, this is, I never calculated, honestly, never. But I'm not exaggerating when I'm saying more than 2 million square meters. More than 2, two million. million square meters, yes. Wow, it's a performance. Yes, it's performance. <laughs> Mr. Filippini, please tell me, um, the botanical garden concept is not one too precious, too hard to make it real here in Blesht? It's, uh, it's not difficult, because mm, there are a team that yeah, they are able to, to, to develop so something unique, so that's why it's just a, a challenge that he can so he can we can skip this but it's not difficult anyhow so there are the, the important things is to follow some nice guidelines yes. okay that yes. the nature guide guide us every day so we just follow this and then it can be implemented in Ploiesti uh, everywhere very beautiful said. Uh, please tell me, do you have in mind a specific theme for this project? Yes, we we I have something in my mind, honestly, and we are developing, we are designing something. But the the main the, the ideas is to to have something um, quite natural. Mm -hmm where the idea is where to only to see the building rise on but on the natural pond with the natural sound with natural taste with natural such a you know smell, smell. exactly mm -hmm. so the idea is to get involved in one of so when you go when you when you go downstairs of your steps when you go out you can breathe so the idea is to be enjoy the nature immediately just one step back of your house you know the idea is this not just a quite flat landscape just deco it's not for us landscape is not just a flower you know it's just a decorative landscape 
the return to nature. Exactly, just something like that. Something, something like, like that. that. I understand. I hope you can enjoy it. Okay. Um, tell me, please, um, how is this project different from other projects of your company? This we are honestly on the way to found it. Okay, because it's not so quite easy to find identity on a project because it's not easy, you know, because we are here, you know, to get inspired by people because who will leave this space, you know, and to the, the unique things, in my opinion, is to, to get to feel the season, to real feel the seasons. Mm -hmm. in, in your private garden, you know, so you can feel winter when there is winter, but in winter there are some flowers that can survive in winter. So you can, Correct. You, you can, you can find the, the flower on your garden. You want to go out, okay, you want to go out to, is, to discover what every day what will happen. Not just, oh, today a roses is pink and oh, tomorrow it's, no. We are looking for, we would like to bring, for example, some plants that can bring butterfly, for example. Wow. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, the name is Budleia. And here it can survive. Mm -hmm. But I, I've never seen a Budleia here, for example. So, some of these specific things that can make it, this project, unique. So, I, I... mean unique in uh, botanical. That's why the project meaning it's botanic. Okay. Please tell me, will you work with uh, specialists uh, from the area or will you bring uh, your own workforce? No, we are used to work with the local, mm -hmm. everywhere. That's even, a good news. <laughs> no, 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 we are used to do. Even in, uh, for example, I'm just back from the uh, United States, mm -hmm. I'm just back from Tashkent, Uzbekistan. So, you know, in every country, because this is our ideas and our, our. Um, this is our own uh, ph ph philosophy. Who made the gardens? You know, who made it? Are able? I can feel that they are uh, their garden. So the workforce will be from here. Yeah, yeah, for local, sure, for local, sure. you local. said. Oh, for sure, and then of course, if there will be some help. Our team can support, can traveling, can travel to support, to check, or to guide them. But uh, we are used to to do a, a good uh, master class, mm -hmm. and then they can maintain it, they can realize it. For sure. Please tell me from where will you bring the soil and plants that uh, you will use? Obviously, local. Local. Yeah, there are no way, no way because only to work with local, the nature can be local. For sure. So, uh, so tell me, I don't know if it's a premature question, but uh, how long will it take you to finish uh, Plurish Gardens? If you're talking about the first uh, steps, or you mean the whole, the, uh, the whole development? The first steps, the entire project, the I don't know, what project? can you tell us now? So I um, during some do you know this discussion with the team. The idea is to close the deal in uh, three years. In three years. Three years, yeah, three four years. Mm -hmm. I mean all the developments. Okay. But the the first phases, I mean in, uh, in less than one year, less than one year. Yeah. That's a good news. Yeah. Uh, tell me what elements do you think will make this um, project a uh, benchmark? I would like to keep this uh, as a secret, honestly, okay. Okay. because uh, for me it can be a benchmark, uh, um, something that for you it, it cannot be. But the idea is the, the, the people, because the, the people mm, will recognize as a benchmark the high quality of life. So I mean the, the idea is to, this is the benchmark. So it's different life in these different uh, housing uh, developments so not, not only for the of course forget about beauty because in my personal opinion it, it must be beauty okay. beautiful it's uh, obviously beautiful 
but the daily life, uh, who will live it, it will be a benchmark for the project. What uh, you anticipated, my uh, next uh, question, uh, what will be the benefits for those who will uh, live in this neighborhood? So I am a father of a daughter, you know, and uh, when, uh, in my, when I the, when decided to live in a place, first is the safety, you know. Safety, okay. Yeah, the safety. And uh, I think this, uh, it can be saved, it can be quiet, it can be good, it can be, you know, uh, environmentally friendly, so they can learn with nature. You know, because now it's in this period, it's not easy, you know, to to live with nature because they are used to, to live in apartment, but there is no green space. So they can only Unfortunately, learn... Unfortunately, yes. Yeah, they can only learn nature on the book. The idea is to learn physically, so living in... So a, not nature from the book, uh, you, you must uh, live. Exactly. You must live. feel. Exactly. Every you, day. Exactly. Where? Not read about it. <laughs> exactly. But you, mm -hmm. and the most important is where exactly are two steps of your door. So that's why. And um, so it's one of these. Uh, there, there will be a list of, you know, good point, goal. But now I feel um, one of these is the guide for, for this uh, um, a strong point of this development. Okay, what um, will be the benefits you told me? Um, how do you think that this project will integrate here in Plesht? Are you optimistic? Yeah, <laughs> the, uh, so the good news are always welcoming, you know, in general, you know, good news are always welcome. I think this project is one of very good news. For the for the for policy. so that's why it can be integrated ANSI. So I mean, it become benchmark because it's so new that can become, uh, you know, uh, they they will become a references for the other the, the new developments. So I would like to have a house if it's not possible in a botanical garden, but I would like a house same like this. So it will become you know, um, a benchmark. Okay. So the idea is the benefit of this and integrated because it will become the, uh, as you know, to told you in English, the right words, but it become uh, the one. So the know, one. Yeah. Okay. It will become the the following, and so integrated because we we are not we will not use. Uh, different so so kind we are not putting palm trees for example in the project okay? okay that's why you feel the same taste of the nature you you, you will see the same colors with different taste but you will see the same uh, landscape there are a few things key points I don't want to tell you the secret now but you will enjoy soon understand um, uh, will it be difficult from your point of view to maintain uh, the green space that you will set up here no no this is no? the last this this is an, a no questions because the green uh, in this case uh, uh, the first point of the owner it was maintenance low cost maintenance and uh, easy maintenance mm -hmm. That's why all the uh, all the trees, all the bushes, shrubs, whatever, it would be just one cutting per year. So you you can uh, have a very 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 we reduce at the minimum the maintenance operation and and of course cost because as you know uh, times are money. <laughs> That's why. Understand. And uh, my last question for you, Mr. Filippini. Do you have a message for the people here in Plaisht? Yes, yes. Uh, we are here to create something uh, unique. We are here to amaze. Wow. And everyone can be can envy this project. You are here to amaze, you said. Yeah. And everyone 
you think will envy, envy yes. the project. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much for uh, this uh, interview. It was a pleasure It's to talk pleasure. to you. It was and my uh, good luck. Thank you very much. We hope to see you again. For sure.